Hello and welcome to all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. I'm Peter Drury, and joining me here, our expert, Jim Beglin. Hello, Peter, and hello to everyone watching. For me, it's a, it's a real thrill to be here. turns on, Jim. I'm going to go for the experienced Igor McInfeyev. He's always been an agile stopper, but having been on the scene from, from such a young age, he's a much calmer decision-maker these days. He would be the obvious choice, wouldn't he? He certainly has all the right qualities. Kola. Pumps it upfield. So what now? No, that's not the ball he wanted. Tries a through ball. Flags up. he's looking for has a hit they scored there is the breakthrough so what's your view on that goal then well his most important job there was to keep the shot down and he did that without any problems that's good concentration you know Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, that lifts some of the pressure, but they need to maintain their work rate. It's been very good up to now. Thrust towards the front line. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, it looked like there that he was asking just a little too much of himself to try and thread that ball through. He was, uh, he was a bit over-ambitious, but I like his thinking. So, they got the only goal to make it 1-0. Dinks one in. Tried to play it through. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. He's made sure that that won't get through. minutes till half time well played he saw that coming
referee's given a throw. For a moment, you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Looks to slip it through. He's got out of play. Looks like a good ball through. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Kola. Done very well to intervene. And the first half is done. Well, they showed glimpses of some wonderful football to go in with the lead at half-time, and that's definitely pleased the fans. I think they'll be looking to keep this intensity up now in the second half. Leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. So, off we go once more. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get more players behind the ball instead of running beyond it. They could even try to, to spoil it from here, we'll see. Now the pass. Shapes the shoots! Oh, surely that deserved better. And it just goes to show you how effective those through balls can be. All it needed was a better execution. Well positioned to make that interception. back on that goal well I thought once he got the first part of it right by getting his knee over the ball it was always likely to be drilled very low and so it proved such a, a polarizing effect on prospective moods I mean one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger another piece of really good defending Listen, I think you can understand at times that the pace of the game pressures players into split-second decisions and sometimes they just make the wrong one. And I think he would have been better placing that. He's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Ignashevich boots it upfield. Looking to shoot! Boots it to safety. Kola really struggling to influence the game. I think if he's going to make better progress, then he's going to need to find a little more space. And uh, I think his team can help out by getting one or two others around him to give him a bit more support as well. Because at this moment, he's just been crowded out and he's not having the impact on the game that he should. Good 
pass on it. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Passes it through. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. And he's there to hoof it away. Ignashevic. Tries a through ball. Sees it out of harm's way. Out for a throw. Oh, good steal, he just read it. Who's going to make this theirs? Goes wide. Promising cross. They didn't manage to get nearly enough into the box, and that speaks of little ambition. The final whistle. So they bask in their win, a genuinely professional performance, and a result which is well-deserved. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Oh, listen, if you've got that kind of power and, and that kind of pace in your team, I think you'll plough through most teams. Those central areas tend to be very congested, lots of traffic going on, but it wasn't a problem for them. So before we go, many thanks to Jim Beglin for his input and from us both, good afternoon.